Come on, hello, how are you? So today, I want to quickly talk about another video in my series for sentence mining. How to use YouTube videos to learn from. So, uh, yeah, I'm using a new piece of software, OBS. Uh, I don't know how good the quality is, so uh, you can let me know in the comment section below after what you think. So basically, yeah, I want to talk a little bit about how we can use YouTube videos to learn. So, first of all, uh, the first thing is see this is only two minutes long here and um, videos are quite short so the first thing you want to find a short video with this is spoken Cantonese subtitles subtitles whatever language you're learning and then um, it wants to have some has wants to be a video that would have a lot of new words there's no point doing this if you're already comfortable understanding you know pretty much everything so what you want to do first of all is uh, put it on loop and then simply literally cover um, cover the subtitles at the bottom manually and listen to it about two three times with just the video without the subtitles uh, depending on what your level is you should be able to understand quite a lot already so listen to it two three times without the subtitles then two three times with the subtitles uh, and then by that point you should probably have identified mo understand most of it but then be a few sentences you're like well what, what does that mean right uh, and that's where the next step comes in so if I just drag this to the left side um, so then what you want to do get a Google document open like this and yeah so then um, we have the Google document open here there and the video on the left so if you come across a if you come across a sentence you don't know then type it out with uh, I use Google input tools here so you type out the sentence here um, most, of the, most of the characters are new but if there's one that I don't know you can always use the draw pad in Google input tools to draw the character out so once you've got the sentence out and then you take the uh, you ping here again you can use Cantonese public dictionary for Google Chrome and just hover your mouse above to get the pronunciation, so then you can see, oh, you enjoy Shin Bo Hoisan, and then you can get the translation of each word individually. So now I'll declare your opening statement, and uh, if you're really unsure on this, I guess you can transfer it over to Bing Translator, Google Translator, something like that, but they're not great. But you know, with the individual word translations and Bing Translate, you should both be able to get pretty uh, good idea of what being said. So. Yeah, so once you've uh, identified all this, you literally go through, oh, hi, guys. and then, you know, if, if I'm struggling with this, you just pause it and then copy the sentence over the ones that you're struggling with. So, once that's done, have all of the sentences into Anki, you'll kind of review them in your flashcards quickly. Uh, this should only be, I guess, four or five sentences. It shouldn't be a lot. Uh, once you've kind of gone over them and... Uh, on them on your flashcards you go back to the start and watch the video again you know, you know maybe two three times uh, now you looked at the difficult bits you should pretty much understand everything in them once you've done that go back cover up the subtitles again and just listen uh, see what you can understand then so it's quite a circular process as obviously this is to train your listening comprehension and the good thing about this is for starts uh, more interesting than learning from a textbook like you YouTube's got billions of hours of content just available, so you know you can find find some interest for anyone really. Um, even in a uh, language like Cantonese, where the majority of subtitles would probably be in standard in Chinese, you still do get quite a few with spoken. Uh, so if if you don't know, if you want some recommendations, then I'll leave a link in the description to my resource page and then scroll down to the YouTube section. I've listed like four or five channels on there uh, I think no sorry like four channels on there and this is uh, this is this one and um, all that I'm listening today and this is kind of like satire cartoons so I said you want to have a few new words you don't know already so this is in the case of a courtroom so there was like um yes yeah, so this is in a courtroom so there's the defend there's new words that I didn't know like uh, defendant um, the prosecution side uh, stuff like that 
so yeah that's it today quite a short video but I hope you find it useful and if there's anything you'd like me to cover in the future then please do leave me a comment and let me know um, if you preferred this recording setup then just go and leave me a comment and let me know in the comment section below so I that's it for today so if you enjoyed this video then uh, give it a like share comment and peace bye bye I see you again now.